how the fuck y'all lose to the Lakers by 20 something damn points or whatever the score was. I can't believe this shit. You know what? My bad. Billy the Angry Knicks fan back at y'all, man. How y'all doing, man? I know it's been a while. I know y'all been asking for videos and shit. I've been trying to be patient with these raggedy motherfuckers, but they just won't want to comply. The only thing consistent with these goddamn Knicks is every January they do this shit. Every January they do this shit to me, man. January come, they act like they don't know what the hell's going on. Man, excuse me, man. I'm trying to watch this old damn game, man. But Philly, man, I mean, Minnesota, they just let me down too. Now I got to see two New York Giant rivals go to the damn Super Bowl. But whatever the case may be, okay? Let me get this text message off the screen, all right? Check this out, Knicks. Every January, y'all do this shit. Y'all want to take, y'all want to get that, them just, just, just let the season go in January. Y'all want to give us a little glimmer of hope or whatever. I know what the hell's going on, all right? Y'all be bullshitting. Y'all probably see why I got a black and white Knicks hat on, man. This shit look dead, huh? That's right. Just like my motherfucking team. They look dead and bland and black and white. Them motherfuckers had no color, no, no life, no nothing in them. It's some bullshit, man. Porzingis, I want to talk about your big ass for a little bit. Your big ass is eight foot seven. And you only average seven rebounds? Are you fucking kidding me? Seven rebounds and you fucking eight foot seven. And keep your ass off the goddamn floor. You on the floor every five fucking minutes for no for no reason at all. Get your ass in that weight room. I'm tired. I'm tired. You motherfucking ass should be tired for being on the motherfucking floor all the time. I'm tired. I can't wait till Tim Hardaway come back. You sound like a bitch. Man, get your shit together, man. No, hell no, y'all. I did not vote for Porzingis in the All-Star game. Why? Because he's tired. He don't need to be playing in the All-Star game if he's tired. Get your rest and come out there and get some damn rebounds, man. There's no way and no reason on earth you should be averaging double-double. That's why your ass didn't get voted as an All-Star starter over Embiid. I don't give a shit what you think the players uh know what's happening. You get a double-double. You 7-3. Seven, 7-3! Three. Seven, three. And you only average seven rebounds. Actually, it's six point something, but motherfuckers want to round up to make your stats look better. Come on, man. That's some bullshit. Man, you talking about you tired. Man, you 22 years old. What you tired of? Cartoons? What you tired of? Because you ain't tired of uh, ish. You ain't tired of winning. Cause that's what we not been doing. The fuck out of here. I'm tired. Man, get your ass together, man. Your PR guy should be slapped. That's some bullshit. My God. Come on, man. I'm tired. Jeff Hornacek, fuck out of here, son. Get out of here, man. I, 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 I kind of like Hornacek. I kind of like it. But the players ain't responding to you. So the players ain't responding to you. I got no use for you. Don't matter if I like you or not. I think you're a pretty decent coach. But the players ain't responding to you, Jeff. Fuck, man. Ain't no way in the world we should have lost a game today with no fucking Lakers. Ain't no way in the world we should have lost a game against the Bulls. Ain't no way in the world we should have lost that game the other night in Memphis. What the fuck, Jeff? Man, the rumors are true about you and you getting fired from Mark Jackson. And damn it, hey, sidearm, Mark, you got to go. Because I want Mark. Mark, a hometown dude. He loved the Knicks, and he got Golden State. And, and he was the Golden State starter kick before Steve Kerr got to them. So, God damn it, I, you got to go. And I say, I'm going to be strong. Going. I don't want, I know how y'all, I know how the, the social media world is. I'm not comparing us to Golden State. I'm not saying nothing, nothing. I'm not saying not, nothing. I'm just saying the man's credentials. That's all I'm saying. Because I know some of y'all like to twist shit. Some of you motherfucking followers out there like to twist shit. Like when I said I didn't vote for poor Zingas, some of y'all, I think you're going over the top. Over the top my ass. He shouldn't have said that shit. All right? Now he can get all the rest he can during the All-Star break. Matter of fact, only take that. Matter of fact, you already been to L.A. Y'all just y'all just left L.A. Because it looked like y'all had an All-Star party last night. That's why y'all come out there playing all flat tonight today against the motherfucking Lakers. Looking like Dookie. Looking straight dookie. Dookie. Where the fuck the defense was at today? Ain't like y'all had a back-to-back. -back. Y'all had a game Friday. You rested all day yesterday, and I saw the damn pics. Y'all all over UCLA campus and shit, taking photos and shit. Should have had your ass right there practicing, and should have had your ass in the motherfucking room getting ready to play for the day. That's some bullshit. Ain't no way the fuck y'all should have lost the Lakers without motherfucking Lonzo or goddamn Cartavius Caldwell Pope. This nigga just got out of jail not too long ago. He coming back, and he's still a factor, even when he not playing. This is some bullshit. Come on, man. Well, y'all saw LeVar Ball? He gave y'all some, some orange and blue uh, Big Baller brand shoes or something. Y'all couldn't blame them up with something. Give me, give me a reason why y'all lost the way y'all lost today. It's some bullshit. 
Now let's talk about that. Now Kimba Walker. I like Frank in the King. I do. I like I like the rookie. But guess what? If we got a chance to get Kim Walker, Frankie baby, you got to go. I want to see what else is proposed to get Kimba Walker. But goddamn, we got a chance to get Kimba, get Kimba. They said they want to negotiate with the Knicks. Let's let's see what Mike got to say. Come on, man, it's Michael Jordan. He's the owner. You know he's gonna fuck it up. Mike ain't no good owner. He's gonna fuck it up. So we can't fuck this up. Come on. The fuck. Nick, y'all piss me off, man. I thought this was going to be the year I changed my Twitter handle. I thought this was going to be the year I changed my Twitter handle from Angry Nick's fan. But it don't look like it. I told y'all, the first video when Jordan's in the snow, I told y'all. Ten games over 500. I think the most we've missed since I made that video, man, it's been three to four games over 500. Man, I swear to God, somebody need to look that up. Man. I think that's where it is. I don't think we've been no further than three or four games over 500 since I made that video, man. That's some bullshit. Bullshit. Fucking Knicks, man. And you yeah, say something else for you motherfucking Knicks fans. Some of y'all, man. Y'all fucking disgust me. You fucking disgust me. Talk about we're re- we are rebuilding. This is what happens when we when uh when you rebuild. We're not rebuilding shit. Only thing we're rebuilding is the fucking box scores. The win and loss. That's the only thing we're rebuilding. The win and loss totals. The fuck you talking about we rebuilding. Rebuilding is when you is what we did seven uh, two years uh, th- two three years ago to get poor Zingas when we won seventeen games. That was rebuilding. What are we doing right now? Uh, I know what we're doing right now. You wanna know what we're doing right now? I'll tell y'all know. We're fucking losing. That's what we're doing. We're losing. You know why we're losing? Because we're going in trying to win. Motherfucker, when you right in rebuilding and you tanking, you just don't give a fuck. Ask Philly. They did it for five years. Shit. They did it for five years. They even had. They even. They still got the fucking same hashtag. Trust the process. Motherfucker, the process is done. All right, y'all got who y'all want. Now y'all rolling with it. Change our fucking hashtag. Our hashtag should be can't get right. That's the motherfucking Knicks. Can't get right. These old garbage ass organization. I went to my first ever Knicks game at the Garden last Sunday, man. Just to see Anthony Davis drop 45, put the whole penis in us. He just put the whole penis in us. No Vaseline, no lotion or nothing. He just gave it to us raw and uncut. We was up by 19, and he just said, okay, I know Billy the Angry Knicks fan is in the building. His first visit at Mass Square Garden. So I'm going to put this whole, this whole thing in him. And he did. And he did. I left Mass Square Garden walking all messed up because Anthony Davis just, uh, he just gave it to me. Why? Because the Knicks will let you down every time. I've never seen a Knicks win in my life when I went to a game. Y'all ain't noticed that. And y'all ain't never know that, man, because I ain't never told y'all. I'm going to share the secret. I've been to 28 Knicks games. 28 Knicks games. I've never seen them win in person. Never. Never. I've never seen. I've never left an arena after a Knicks win. They never won, y'all. When I went last Sunday, that was number 28. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. Log on to Facebook, man. Go to Fort Knicks, man. Fort Knicks. F-O-R-T Knicks. Omni fan. Go to Knicks Omni fan as well, man. Y'all support support the groups, man. Support all that, man. And ask them, has Billy the Angry Knicks fan ever seen the Knicks win in person? They will tell you no because I told them, don't say nothing at the game. They said something at the game. They curse us in the fourth quarter. It was terrible. Man, the Knicks are fucking dookie. You're dookie. I mean, I'm talking about the long dookie streaking and draws dookie. They just terrible. I'm talking about the kind of dookie that just had that, that streaking and draws and make you want to just throw your draws away. Don't even try to watch them dookie. Man, get this shit together. Scott Perry, what you going to do for us Knicks fans, huh? What you going to do for us Knicks fans, huh? We tired of seeing you smiling. Do something. Do something. Get us excited about something, man. We still got a chance to save the season. We are, the, we are in the Eastern Conference, so we still got a chance to save the season. Do something. Shit. Porzingis, you need to start having double-double. Karen, I love your love, the heart, love, the passion. Leave the fucking LeBron alone. LeBron team is still fucking winning, all right? Y'all ain't winning, Karen. Leave LeBron alone. Even though I hate fucking LeBron, fuck him. But God damn it, he's, still, he's winning. He's still winning, all right? Leave LeBron alone, Karen. Y'all should have got trolled today by the way y'all motherfucking showed up in L.A. That was fucking terrible. Y'all lost to the fucking Lakers? To the Lakers? Come on, man. I'm not saying the Lakers are a bad team. But damn, we shouldn't have lost that game. Not the way we did. Come on, man. This is some bullshit. Can't leave LeBron alone, all right? Jerry Jack. Congratulations, Jerry Jack. All right? Congratulations. That's cool, man. Congratulations that you, that you, that you 
you know, you got a contract for the rest of the season. Because you've been kind of balling ever since you signed that little contract. So, congratulations, okay? Porzingis, shut the fuck up. Quit crying. Quit flopping. And play some fucking basketball. Get big. Get in the fucking weight room. Do something. Hardaway Jr., you actually been playing pretty good since you've been back from injury. I ain't got too much to say about you. You've been playing pretty good. Courtney Lee been playing pretty good, too. But fuck. Hornet said, fix the rotation. If you don't like Willie Gomez, either trade him or do something. But I like Willie Gomez. I think he's okay. But you must not like him for some reason. Be easy. Be easy. You playing okay. We got a decent-ass team. Why the fuck we can't win? I'm naming all these people. I'm not really mad at too many players. I'm just mad at poor Zingas, punk ass. The fuck? I got to see Philly go to the fucking Super Bowl, too? This is fucking terrible. Fix this shit, Knicks. Sorry, motherfuckers.